with you if you got me Yeah, she from Colombia Lil' mama, I want all of ya Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I am recording a workout video today. Um, this is like an at-home workout video because um, I'm not going to the gym today and this is what I do when I work out at home. I normally just do legs at home because I work out with my mom every day and we don't like going into like this one corner where all the machines that we need are at LA Fitness because there's too many people there. So we do these exercises at home. And this is also what I've been doing like while we were quarantined. So it's really short. It's just three to four exercises and that's literally it. Um, I normally try to keep it around four exercises even at the gym, but um, these are all exercises you should do if you're starting to like build your butt and you want to get a bigger butt because these are the exercises that are going to do it. They're like the classic, most like specific way to get it like this is literally like all that extra stuff like the fire hydrants and the hip adductor and all that it's good but these are like the things that are really gonna like grow your butt those will grow it but these are like the basics you know what I mean so I'm just gonna drink a pre-workout not pre-workout but I'm drinking this no fusion I don't really know it's like a pre-workout so I'll be right back I'm gonna go drink this and I also drink it while I'm working out and I also have water so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and start working out well I'm not gonna start but like I'm just gonna go and then you'll see what I'm doing at the gym so this is what I'm wearing since I'm home in my gym and not at the gym so they're just these little shorts sports bra and sneakers so <laughs> stupid. Hey guys, I'm trying to connect my Bluetooth to this. But yeah guys, so I'm gonna just play music because I can't work out in silence and then I'm gonna record and then um I'm gonna do like a voiceover. <laughs> This does not work out. She says blue to me. Like, no, right now. Start. Music. Oh my god. <laughs> Um, if you don't have one of those like shoulder pads for like a bar or something, cut a noodle. Literally take the noodle, cut it to the length you want it, and then just cut it down the middle. And it just. And that's sticks. from the dollar store. 
So it's really good. You can do that. Or, you put your hip thing too. Yeah, when you do the hip thrust, or you can take. I'll show you guys how I do it when I do the hip thrust. I think it's better. My mom likes this, but personal preference. But as you can see, what I just did was four sets of squats. I did um, three sets, adding weight to each round, and then the last round, the last round, I did no weight but the bar. The bar is about, I think it's 35 pounds of bar, so it's really, really light. So I just take it and I pulse for 25 and then on the 25th one, I hold it there at the bottom and then I come up and squeeze and make sure you're squeezing your butt every time you come up and you're never ever pushing from the toes. When you're doing a squat, you wanna always focus like right here. Like not just on your heel, but kind of like in the middle. Like it's all like mind muscle connection. So just try to concentrate. I promise you'll feel it. You won't get huge quads. Like you guys know, I don't like big legs. Like I personally think it's not that feminine, so I, how I train my body, I train it to have, to be very proportioned. You don't want to be too exaggerated in anything. Unless you like it. Unless you like it, but for me, I like being proportioned. I don't like anything too exaggerated, so I just do what I know, like, works for me. So maybe if you like the same thing, you can do the same. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm like, ow, <laughs> I'm like sweating. But, oh my god. <laughs> be careful. But now we're gonna do lunges with weights on our ankles and holding weights to the side, or you can do the bar. I'm gonna personally do the bar because I don't have the best balance, so lunges is gonna help me balance better. So that's what we're gonna do next. So stay tuned. So I got these from I think Dix was... Sporting Goods. Oh, Amazon. No, I got them on Dix. Oh. Yeah, I got them from Dix, and I just had them shipped to me during quarantine because I really like that machine at the gym where you kick back at a, ow, at LA Fitness, but um, obviously the gym was closed, so we had to find an alternative. So I bought these. These are 10 pounds. You might think it's not a lot, but I'm telling you, when you start doing it, and then you take them off and you do the last set with no weight, your legs are gonna feel like noodles. Like, it literally hurts so bad. But, well not hurt, but you feel how heavy it actually is. So, this is what I'm doing now. And then, when you lunge, when you come up, you wanna kick. Oh my God, you fit, you're like clumsy you, girl. You just kick back. So, you're gonna lunge and then kick back. I'll show you guys. Here you can lean honestly against anything, but I lean against this because it's the only like stable thing we have. So um, just try to improvise, it doesn't have to be perfect, but you know, you'll learn on the way. You can get a chair, put it against the wall or a bench or something. But yeah, so what I'm gonna do is put this around my thighs because it's gonna cause more tension um, for when I go like this on my glutes. Because when you do hip thrusts, you want to make sure you're concentrating 
looking straight at something and as you're thrusting up, you're squeezing your butt literally as hard as you can. And when you get to the top, go out with your legs because that's gonna get this muscle over here. For me, that's really hard to grow for some reason. I don't know why. Like, I have like more of like a, like a heart-shaped butt, I guess you could say. It's hard for me to grow this area and like the side of my butt. Like if you look to the side, my butt doesn't look like that big. It kind of looks like, like that. But like if you look to the back, it's more like, like that. I don't know, everyone has a different butt shape. Like some people from the side, they have like a huge like ass and then from the back, like it's not as like plump. But that's just on your body's genetics. You can't change that. But you can do things to make it grow. Like I do a lot of these to help grow this area and that machine where you go like this is really good for that area, this is really good for that area, and then I do the hip abductor and this exercise to work that side part of your butt. And it's gonna just make your butt bigger, but yeah, that's my tip. To me, this is the best exercise literally ever for your butt. Like you will feel it instantly and you'll be sore the next day, I promise you. If you do it properly, you'll Feel it on what you literally only have to do that and like one other thing and you can have a good like day if you do like a bunch of them but i'm going to do three sets of heavy weight and then um the last set i'm going to do no weight so yeah let's get started so now i'm going to have a shake i'm having this one from dang I like the chocolate flavor the best, but it doesn't really matter. They're all really good. And I'm just gonna have, I normally have it with almond milk, but we don't have any more, so I'm just gonna have it with water today. I don't like to put too much water, because I like it a little bit like thicker. That's why I like to use the milk, but it's whatever. All right guys, so I just finished having I'm having I just finished working out and now I'm having my protein shake and um, I'm just gonna shower get ready and record another video for you guys and then I have to do some homework and yeah all that good stuff so I'm gonna go ahead do the rest of my day and I'll see you guys tomorrow um, let me know what other videos you want to see I'll have a try and haul this week and all that other good stuff so a vlog too and a cooking video probably I have some ideas so yeah thanks for watching guys hopefully this workout helps you guys grow your booty that's helped me so yeah just be consistent lift heavy and that is all and don't overtrain. I only train legs twice a week don't overdo it because your muscles need a break but yeah that's about it guys thanks for watching have a make sure you like comment share and subscribe turn on those notifications and have a great day and a blessed rest of your day